As we have many a morning, you'll probably need a jacket to start your morning off as temperatures will be close to freezing early on in the morning. By noon, how about 55 degrees and partly sunny and a high near 60. Pretty good weather in my book. Severe weather index staying in the low category and our weather story talking about a warm up tomorrow. Then it's going to stay warm for the next couple of days after that. Now highs today were only in the lower 50s, but look at how warm it got to our west. Minneapolis 61, Des Moines 70 degrees. Well, our winds are coming out of the south and southwest, and that will help to bring in more of that mild air. Now the clouds right now, it looks worse than it actually is. Just some high clouds squirting across Wisconsin. Uh, very dry weather with it, and really the center of this little storm system, which is right here, is heading basically into Canada away from us, so there's not a storm system we have to worry about. So we're just going to continue to see those mild winds come on through tonight and into tomorrow, and that's why we're expecting high temperatures back in the 60 degree mark. Isn't that nice? But, you know, I look back last year at this time, we also had 60s. As a matter of fact, I believe it was 68 degrees a year ago tomorrow. Now to our west, we're going to start to see a little storm system begin to develop, and there is going to be some colder air with this one. You notice some blues on the map. That is in the form of snow expected in the high plains of the west. Eventually, the storm system is going to be pulling out and producing some rain for us, but that's going to be late and into Wednesday. Area temperatures running like this, 39 in Sturgeon Bay, 35 in Green Bay, 38 in Oshkosh, holding out of 43 down in Fond du Lac. So for tonight, mostly clear. A low temperature of 33 degrees. Tomorrow, there's that high of 60. A southeasterly wind at 5 to 10 will keep the lakeshore just a little bit cooler, probably in the upper 50s. Three day forecast dry Tuesday and 58, 56 with a chance for rain on Wednesday. And then look at Thursday, 53 degrees before we get colder, much wetter weather for the weekend. Rain and 43 on Saturday, 41 with a chance for some flurries. Just want to let you know that uh, Winter Awareness Week starts tomorrow. We're going to have a, a series of stories starting on Monday. Winter storm names on Tuesday. We'll talk about winter warnings and advisories. Wednesday, the 2000s, yeah, that was a real snowy decade. We'll tell you how it stacks up against the history of our weather here in Wisconsin. Patrick's snow forecast is going on on Thursday. You'll want to check that out. And on Friday, do we have enough salt for the season? Meteorologist Sandra Tutt will take a look at how communities are stockpiling the salt. Very interesting. And I saw a few little flurries in your uh, seven-day forecast there. Yes. Uh, we're not quite sure how deep the cold air is going to get. But at this mm. point in time, we could see some flurries, maybe even central or western Wisconsin, accumulating snow. Wow. Mm. We'll look forward to that. <laughs> or not. Thanks, Doug.